Welcome back to our kitchen. Today we have something in store for you, which is different. It is called pumpkin stew. Yes, I said it, pumpkin stew. Before we go further, let me show you what I have here for the pumpkin stew. The pumpkin has already been steamed. It's over here. And I have the seasonings over here. I have the seasoning all with herbs and spices, half of an onion, black pepper, tomatoes, hot pepper, and three garlic cloves. Over here in the pot, I have um, smoked turkey that is already cooked. Over here I have steamed seasoned shrimp and just a piece of chicken, leftover chicken from Thanksgiving that has been toasted. This is what we have for the meats. And I'm coming over here to start the blending the tomato, pepper, and, gar and garlic. We just get into the blender over here. Okay, I'm blending them right now. Okay, I'm starting off by frying the onion. Lowering temperature. I'm adding the tomato, garlic, and pepper. Ah, this one is hot. And now we should fry. the seasoning. Add the seasoning all over here for a little bit first with some of the black pepper. I will allow it to fry. Cook the onions a little bit before adding your other ingredients. For a while the stew is Simmering, let me remove the smoked turkey because this is also going to be added to the pumpkin stew. It smells real good right now. So, to this stew, I'm adding um, the steamed shrimp first because it's not fully cooked. Next, I'm adding the smoked turkey, which is which has been seasoned, and the last meat will be the leftover roasted chicken. Now I'm adding I'm adding the pumpkin to the stew. Give it a stir. A little more seasoning to it. With the remaining tomato and peppers and a little bit more black pepper i'm adding the turkey broth just making sure i'm not adding a lot because um, the pumpkin is already cooked just a little bit of broth in there this should be okay so we allow it to boil and simmer don't go away we'll be right back as you can see, we're almost there. We allow the pumpkin stew to cook at least for eight minutes. The reason is because the pumpkin is already cooked, so you don't need you don't need it to boil like a lot, at least for eight minutes. Everything else um, is cooked in, especially the onions. You want the onions to fry before you go through the process. The onion has to be cooked as well. Let me give it a taste. Mmm, oh my God, this is delicious. You need to try this. Don't go away, we will be right back. Here we have the pumpkin stew. Hope you try it. It doesn't take long. Preparation is very, very, very minimal. So I want you to try this recipe and let me know in the description box. You will not be sorry that you did. It is delicious. So fast, so simple. So until then, thank you for watching. All the subscribers, we appreciate you joining us. And until then, we'll see you again. Take care. Bye.